cannot afford to do the billions of miles in the physical world that would be required to validate a fully autonomous car. Those can only be done in the virtual world. Transit is an icon for Ford globally, and it's an icon within the UK as well. Why Transit has been so successful is how capable it, it has been in meeting customers' requirements. And over the 50 years, those customer requirements change. The challenge with modern vehicles is they're incredibly complex, and part of that is because our customers are always wanting more out of them. Add on to that the challenges around net zero and electrification, and that really makes the system a lot more complex to make sure we tick all those boxes and get the customer what they need. We're looking to augment and complement the physical testing that we're currently planning and grow the capability of how much data we can get through using, in parallel to vehicle testing, using virtual testing. There are two reasons why the APC is funding Vivid. Firstly, is it can accelerate the development of sustainable vehicles through using these digital engineering tools. And secondly, it can anchor and grow these new digital skills and capabilities here in the UK. Through Vivid, we created simulation models of components critical to electrification, such as electric motors, batteries, and also sensors. And we also looked at integration at systems level and optimization. Our simulation work feeds directly into the development of the new Ford Transit, and it is also supported by experimental facilities that address all aspects of electrification. We've used the IPG software to develop those models. And we've done that for advanced powertrain modelling of the system, the ADAS functionality, and then the vehicle dynamics and behaviour of that vehicle. We've brought all of those together into one place. The model-based systems engineering approach takes into account the whole vehicle and looks at how we can improve the efficiency, whether it be the design of the control systems through to how the performance of the vehicle is developing. Vivid has been a really fantastic partnership between IPG Automotive and Ford. We've really grown our commercial vehicle expertise and the software that we've been using has really helped to increase the number of tests that can be done much earlier in the time frame. One of the major contributions of Lafford to the Vivid project was um, thermal simulations of uh, the full vehicle, including the powertrain, uh, electronics, the motor uh, and the cabin and that is very, very important with today's electric vehicles to get right and be able to predict the performance because everything relies on battery charge and you don't want to feel cold in the winter when driving your electric transit. We've created a simulation architecture where we can have an experimental battery in the loop but then we can very easily switch back to a simulated battery in the loop. So within this room, we have the compact simulator. We're able to bring digital models of the vehicle into this scenario and assess their performance and understand and feed back to the driver how that vehicle's performing. So we have a good understanding of where we are in that program of how that vehicle will behave when we release it to the market. Let's imagine we've got some parking scenarios we want to test and there might be uh, some cameras that need to pick up what's going on around the vehicle so that the driver can see what they need to see. We can test exactly what the driver's going to see, we can put cameras anywhere around the vehicle, we can also change the conditions that the vehicle's existing in. So it might be dark, it might be daytime, it might be raining. We can affect all of this within those parking scenarios. And we can change those surroundings as well to have cars or obstacles in other places. Ford would need an army of vehicles, an army of engineers, and a huge amount of time to complete the physical testing. And that's what Vivid was all about, working with our partners to understand what are the new tools available, integrating those into Ford, yes, for the autonomous driving area, but for other areas as well. Working with IPG Automotive, Loughborough University, and Hariba Mara, their individual skills are crucial to the overall delivery of Vivid, of delivering those simulation tools and capabilities into Ford Motor Company. In the virtual world, it only rains when we tell it to.